Welcome to another installment of Bearing the Axis Blocks. This one is a little different because I actually didn't make it for you. I um, recorded this ritual for a friend with whom I timed it. So he was doing the same thing as I was, um, but in America. So this is for my very dear friend, but I am sharing it with you because you have asked me before if I wanted to share some of my rituals. So here is a part of the Numania ritual I did, and I hope you enjoy it. Um, unlike the other ones, there isn't any explanations or anything on what I'm actually doing. Um, but you can see the link below in my description for more on it. And else there is always the comment section. Thank you for watching. Okeanus, whose nature ever flows, and from whom first both God and man arose, sire incorruptible, whose waves surround an earth's all terminating circle bound, and every river, and every wide spreading sea, and earth's pure bubbling springs from thee. Hear, mighty sire, for boundless bliss is thine, greater cathartic the power divine. Earth's friendly limit, fountain of the core, whose waves white screaming and white spreading and circumfluent roar, approach benevolent, the placid mind, and be forever to thy mystic's kind. Blessed Goddess Estia, she intends to the holy house of the Lord Apollo, the far shooter of Google Piper, the soft toil spreading ever from your loss. Come now into this house, come, that being of one mind, and seems the all wise. Come forth, and with all the still grace upon my song. Accept my offering of only two twice. Sweet your hand and watch over these rites. As the gods will it, so shall it be. And next, sweet voice muses, daughter of Zeus, well skilled in song, tell of the long winged moon. From her immortal head, a radiance is shown from heaven and embraces earth. And great is the beauty that, th that arises from her shining light. The air, unlit before, glows with the light of a golden crown and a rays being clear. Whensoever bright Selene, having bathed her lovely body in the waters of the ocean and donned her far gleaming raiment and yoked a strong necked shining team, drives on her long maned horses at full speed. And every time in the mid-month, then in her great orb is full, and then her beams shine brightest as she increases, so she is sure token and sign to mortal men. Once the son of Cronus was joined with her in love, and she conceived and bare a daughter, Pandia, exceeding lovely amongst the deathless gods. Hail, white-armed goddess, bright Selene, mild, bright-tressed queen, and now they will leave you and sing the glories 
of man half divine, who is each minstrels and servants of the muses celebrate the lovely look. To you I too offer offerings of sweetest wine, and honey sweet. that your bright rays may ever see favorably upon me. I sing of Artius with shafts that are of gold. Strong voice, the revered virgin, deer shooter, the lighter in arrows. Own sister to Apollo with the golden sword. Over the shadowy hills and windy peaks she draws her golden bow, rejoicing in the chase and sends her grief as shafts. Hail to you, children of Zeus and Leto. And now we will remember you, and another song also. Blessed God is Artemis, for shooter, the iron archer, sister to a common. Accept these offerings, honestly, wine. And we can sweet your honey. And to all the gods I pray that many blessings may go with you, and that the gods may watch from heaven over me and guard us with favorable fortune, and that offer the sweetest wine to all the gods. And then after all, the sweetest honey to all the gods. May you ever watch favorably upon us. And finally, I sing again with Estia, goddess of home and heart. I thank you for attending every rite and accepting every prayer and every libation and every sacrifice. Because you know the value of family and of the oikos, and you willingly carry my voice up to the gods, so as the gods will it. So may you ever stand beside me and ever guard the oikos and ever guard those in it. As the gods will, so shall it be.